Hello everyone, I'm Santiago Santiago and today I'm going to be testing the Max Payne franchise. To skip down those three games tested, check the timestamps down in the description. So for Max Payne 1 and 2, I had to apply a couple of fixes that allow us to get modern resolutions working and avoid some of the crashes. You can find them down in the description. I usually like to revisit older games using higher resolutions on modern hardware. In this case, for the first two games, I use 4K and of course, due to the age of these titles, you can easily get past 100 frames per second. So there's not much else to say about them and I'll talk to you again on Max Payne 3. A massacre. These armed thugs just appeared from nowhere. We need to get help. I can make the call from the control room one floor up. Can you take me there? Sure. Sounds good. Follow me. Home free. This way. Damn. Look out! Ah! The train lit up like a Christmas tree. The power was back on. being subtle. With no way to deal with the past, I kept my eyes on the road, off the rear view mirror and the road kill behind me. I chased lesser mysteries, other people's crimes. You know, officer, you cop got Herb's disguise didn't fool me. He was leading me into a trap. The perps were masquerading as cleaners. Uh, 
I'm not a violent man by nature, but it pisses me off more than anything. Hey! Ah! Hoffman's waiting at the van. The hardware's been bagged. As soon as the guys get Jackie Brown in there taken care of, we're done. Storage, but it had been cleaned out. The answering machine had a message on it. I told you to sit down. can it take? They're not supposed to cuddle with her afterwards. We need to wrap this up. There! Come on! If you think nothing can get to you, you're lying to yourself. At best, you're temporarily dead. A lightning bolt can reanimate you without a warning. My backup had arrived, but the cleaners were slipping away, making a run for it. And now I'm just in Max Payne 3. I didn't need to apply any fixes to this game manually like on the previous titles. This one has a pretty good options menu, but I recommend avoiding MSAA unless you do 1080p or something like that. Performance is great, but once smoke shows up, it can tank the FPS quite a bit. Fortunately, that's something that happens very few times throughout the story, so I wouldn't worry too much about it. But yeah, not much else to say. All the games in the franchise run well. I highly recommend it. It's super cheap on Steam sales but I recommend avoiding the Rockstar Pass for Max Payne 3. That's DLC for the multiplayer mode, which is dead. But anyway guys, that's about it. I hope you enjoyed this video, thanks for watching, and see you next time! I hadn't seen it coming. 
But that was no surprise. It's hard to keep your eye on the ball through the bottom of a glass. The door... Son of a bitch! Somos o comando, sir! 